doctors around the globe are now looking into whether the COVID-19 coronavirus is a bigger threat to children than previously thought. It is now being reported in the United States that the sick children has symptoms similar to Kawasaki disease. This rare illness is called Pediatric Inflammatory Multisystem Syndrome. This inflammatory complication in children with possibly links to COVID-19 has caused fatalities in many countries. 1. The governor of New York in the United States, Andrew Cuomo, is now warning that COVID-19 in children can cause more serious symptoms. There are about five deaths in New York that are being linked to COVID-19 of about 100 reported seriously ill children. Andrew Cuomo also said that many COVID-19 test positive children brought to hospitals did not display respiratory symptoms commonly associated with COVID-19. Two, in the United Kingdom, a 14-year-old boy reportedly died from the Kawasaki-like COVID-19 possibly caused illness. Matt Hancock, the health secretary in Great Britain, said that some children with no underlying health conditions have died from a rare inflammatory syndrome which researchers believe to be linked to COVID-19 coronavirus. Officials have refused to say how many British children have been affected by this illness, but up to 20 have fallen critically sick, according to reports. 3. Doctors in northern Italy have reported large numbers of children under age 9 severely ill with Kawasaki-like disease, which is more common in parts of Asia. Italian medical experts are investigating a possible link between COVID-19 and infants who are arriving at hospitals with high fevers and swollen arteries. 4. The Spanish Pediatric Association said COVID-19 test positive or antibodies positive children have presented gastrointestinal symptoms such as abdominal pain, vomiting, and diarrhea in the last two weeks before coming to the hospital. 5. Canadian doctors are looking into whether sick children in Montreal, Quebec, with severe inflammatory complications, could have been triggered by COVID-19. The Canadian Pediatric Society is collecting data from 2,800 pediatricians across the country to provide a more accurate picture of the toll coronavirus infection is taking on children's bodies. Canada's top children's hospital, the Hospital for Sick Children, has placed staff on high alert because this rare inflammatory syndrome seems to be related to the COVID-19 infection. As always, thanks for watching. Please thumbs up, share, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Again, try to be grateful and think positive.